What is going on everybody? It is Foreign and welcome back. Um, so I have some news and some updates for you guys. So I just got back from my trip last night um, about 12 hours ago. Uh, I finally got home around midnight. Uh, we left at around, I want to say 10 a.m. Uh, Eastern. And, uh, oh man, I feel like shit. So I'm going to kind of explain to you guys what happened. Um, something did happen. Any of you guys that are following me on Twitter, you guys already know what happened. If you don't follow me on Twitter and you do care about getting updates when you're not seeing videos or listening to me talk about whatever, feel free to follow me on Twitter. Link will be in the description. But basically, we had a 13-hour drive from New York to Wisconsin. And right when we get into Chicago... We're, we're like just south of downtown, so we're, we're getting pretty close to downtown, the heart of it all. And we get in a fender bender. Now, some of you guys don't actually know this. Um, most of you do, because I, I say it all the time. But my girlfriend is pregnant, and we got into a fender bender. Um, luckily, the airbags did not deploy, so that was one thing that we didn't have to worry about. Um, but we did get into a car accident. Uh, we were at a complete stop in stop and go traffic. Uh, the person behind us braked a little too late and probably hit us going mm, maybe 10, 15 miles an hour, which doesn't seem like much. But for someone that's pregnant, that can be life or death. So needless to say, we were both in absolute shock. Um... For probably about an hour after the accident, we didn't feel the baby move. Um, so, obviously, that had us both extremely worried. Uh, it took approximately an hour for um, police and an ambulance to arrive, which was much longer than it should have been, uh, seeing as how we called within the first 10 minutes of the accident. Um, and then called two additional times after that. Uh, once they arrived, the paramedic, yeah, paramedics saw Denise. Um, luckily, they, they were able to hear a heartbeat. Um, and the baby had started moving. So everything was good on that front. Um, they suggested that we go to the hospital. Um with us being in Chicago and not being in Milwaukee where you know we're from we don't really know the area um, so we we decided not to go to the hospital there we proceeded home uh, took us about an hour and a half from where we were and then we went to our personal physician um, and they checked her out and everything everything was good uh, basically they monitor uh, when, when you're pregnant and you get into a car accident, what they do is they, they like to monitor you for four hours or, yes, up to four hours after the crash um, with the one, the police and ambulance taking so long. That was an hour. Uh, the rest of the drive was probably about an hour and a half on top of the half hour of waiting around once they actually did arrive. Um, so we didn't actually have to stay in the ER for very long. Everything was good, um, so we're both very thankful. I would just like to add that this is not an April Fool's joke whatsoever. This is a very serious situation that has happened to us. Uh, my neck's a bit sore. I actually saw the impact coming, and I tensed up, um, which obviously is the worst thing to possibly do. Um, and this is also... I would like to just tell people out there that if you ever get in a car accident, be sure to call somebody that you know if you don't know what to do because out of just sheer panic, um, the person had pulled over and I, I didn't know what to do and all, all that I ended up getting was their name and their phone number um, and I know now and after they had left, that that was a terrible, terrible idea because now this is all on me. Um, luckily, I think that insurance will end up paying uh, a bit of the deductible because it is considered a hit and run. Um, 
because they did leave the scene of the crime before uh, police arrived. Um, but yeah, we are we're home safe. We had a great time in New York. I'll tell you guys a little bit about that right now. We had a great time. We had a baby shower. Um, we got tons of great things. We got some some uh, some bounce arounds and some some high chairs and stuff like that, and a ton of clothes, tons and tons of clothes. Got a bunch of stuffed animals, and honestly, we were just both ecstatic. We are so excited for her to finally be here, and I'm excited for you guys to get to meet her. So, anyways, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, there will be a squad cast tonight. It will be shorter than normal. I need to get my rest. So, I'm trying to just get a bunch of stuff done so that I can... I can do nothing for a while because, like, like I said, um, I'm still, um, I'm a bit, I'm a bit sore from from the accident. So, um, anyways, I hope that you guys enjoyed, and I will talk to you later. Bye.